Baby, it's cold outside. Hey, it's Gilbite here. In this video, we're going to talk about when you need to use the emergency heat function on your heat pump. So without getting into too much detail, a heat pump, that's something that those of us in the South have quite often, where it doesn't get cold that often. The way it works in the winter to heat the house is it pulls the heat out of the air outside brings it in via the refrigerant to the inside coils where air blows over it, distributing it through your vents into the house. That's how it warms it up. Well, heat pumps are great. They're efficient. Down to about 30 degrees. And then around 30 degrees, depending on how, how efficient your unit is, depending on whether you have the correct refrigerant level, how clean the coils are, that type of thing, will determine how efficient it is and how cold it can get outside and still be efficient to heat the inside. Well, what happens when it does get below that point? So at some point, usually in the 20s, your heat pump is gonna stop working efficiently. And depending on how cold it is, it can get cold enough where it just can't heat the house. And what'll happen is, the outside coils are gonna freeze up. Well, when it freezes up, it's gotta go into a defrost mode. Guess what happens when it goes to defrost mode? It switches it over where it's pulling heat out of the inside of the house to get it out there and defrost those coils via the refrigerant so it's pulling heat out. Well, then it defrosts, then it kicks back into the heat to try to heat your house up, then it'll freeze up again and you're in an endless loop. So what the emergency heat does is inside your unit, the inside of the house part of it, you've got an electrical heater. So these electrical coils, basically it sends uh, electric current through it and heats it up just like a lot of your space heaters work. So when do you need to enable emergency heat? Well, most units will automatically kick in the emergency heat, or some will call it auxiliary heat, and that's those electronic coils that are in there to supplement the heat pump. Most of them will, so, but yours may or may not. You may have to look, do some research on yours. Now, what I suggest Look at, watch your thermostat when it's cold and make sure that it's keeping up and that it's not freezing up outside. And if that's the case, then you should be fine. However, if something happens to where it's not keeping up or, you know, maybe the outside unit got damaged by a tree limb or something falling on it, then you want to manually flip it over to emergency heat that way when it is uh when it the temperature is below what it should be it will use the electrical coils to supplement the heating and if if it's the outside unit has been damaged and it's the heat pump itself is not working that will give you some heat until you can have someone come and repair the unit so hope that was helpful if so please like subscribe comment and good luck with yours